How many of you struggle with rounded posture or rolled shoulders? Okay, this issue can be caused from a couple things. One, being tight shoulders and tight core, not enabling you to extend up and open out. And second, being weakness through the upper back or the extensor muscles. So here's an exercise for you today that can help address both of those, both of those issues. So first, a couple points, you're gonna get down to the floor. Down here, thinking proud posture, okay, a couple points here. Proud posture, meaning I'm extending up as much as I can. Proud posture, open up. Support your head off of your hand, or if you have a short foam roller, you can have your head, or a couch cushion, your head on top of that, okay? Second here, we wanna make sure that our knees aren't gonna slide apart throughout the movement. Imagine they're tied together here. There's not a sliding of the upper leg across the lower leg. From here, we're gonna put our thumb down to the floor, and remember, proud posture, puff, puff your chest as much as you can. You're gonna drag your thumb across the floor. You're gonna open up, around, try and make sure you have enough space where you're not gonna hit furniture, come back around, okay? That's one repetition. We're gonna go for 10 to 15 there. Now, for some of you, this is what's gonna happen. You're gonna go to come up and around, you're gonna be fine here, fine here, no problem there. And then uh, you're gonna hit a wall and then able to, in order for you to keep going, you're gonna have to lift your hand. Still, keeping the same. Proud posture, knees staying together, hand is just above the ground here. You're gonna get that same stretch through the front of the shoulder. A lot of tightness through here. Do not race through. Take your time. We're trying to elicit some change in the tissue here. We're trying to improve joint position. So again, chest up, come up around, feel that stretch. Head follows your hand, come back around and back down. So again, there and back is one repetition. You're gonna shoot for around 10 to 15. Don't race through it, take your time. You're gonna go 10 to 15 per side, about two to three rounds. Initially, if you have rolled, rolled shoulders or poor posture, I'd recommend doing this every single day. Probably the start of your day or right before you start a workout would be a good idea. As you, your position improves, as your posture improves, you're gonna find you don't need to do it quite as often. You're gonna do more of what, what would be a, a maintenance routine. Go through a couple of those at the start of a workout, both sides, move on to your, your next exercise and go forward with your workout. You won't require to do it as often once the position improves to maintain it. Okay, I hope that helps. If you have any questions, comments, leave them in the section below.